Well, now to a story you'll only see on News 5. Team USA skeleton racer Katie Ulander is now in line for her first Olympic medal. This after Yelena Nikitina and other Russian athletes were stripped of their 2014 Sochi medals for doping. It's a ruling that came down last week. News 5's Katie Blaze sat down with Ulander today. She joins us live in studio. Now, Katie, this is a pretty big deal for this Olympian. Yeah, Zach, that is for sure. But as Ulander tells me, it's not because of the medal, but more so that something is finally being done to make sure it's a cleaner field for the upcoming Winter Games in South Korea. The Russians have been stripped. They're banned for life. You are now an Olympic bronze medalist. It was this phone call from her head coach, Tuffy Latour, that left Katie Ulander speechless. My first response was, Tuffy, this was a team effort. This is for us. And then I got emotional and started crying. As she says, for so many reasons. It's a huge relief, mostly for me, like from my perspective, uh, having Nicotina still race and having just won the Park City race. I just kept thinking she's going to steal someone else's moment or even mine again. That moment was in 2014 during the Sochi Winter Games. Ulander took fourth while Russian athlete Yelena Nikitina got the bronze, a medal that could now be given to Ulander. Nikitina was stripped of hers following a doping investigation. This to me is a huge step. Like I commend the IOC for taking a stand and, and doing something. It's a moment she wished she could share with her best friend and fellow teammate Steve Holcomb, who passed away earlier this year. I wouldn't have gotten the call from Tuffy, it would have been a <laughs> from Holcomb because he was so passionate and just fired up about it. While missing her best friend, she's honoring him by training hard for the Winter Games in South Korea. When asked if she'll be on the podium come February, I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> like life is so unpredictable. I mean, that's that's the thing I'm learning is the results aren't aren't something I should be focusing on. It's, if I can focus on being at my absolute best, you know. Oh, I'm praying that's enough. Now I'm not chasing a medal, I'm chasing my moment. Well, the Russian Bobsled and Skeleton Federation said athletes will appeal the ruling. That's according to Russian news agency TASS. And because of the appeals process, Ulander isn't quite sure when she will get the medal. Zach? Katie, thank you.